driver accused of hitting a blind man and his guide dog and then taking off is now behind bars. Salem police arrested 49-year-old Donald Kroom. Today, he faced a Marion County judge. Our Amy Frazier is live in Salem with more on this crime alert. Amy? Today I spoke with the victim's wife. She tells me this whole thing has been surreal. She also says they're relieved that the driver has been caught. 48-year-old Stephen Murphy is recovering at a Salem hospital. He was badly hurt in the hit and run, including a broken nose, broken ribs, a fractured pelvis, and his wife says his left knee is destroyed. Monday evening, Murphy had dinner at South Liberty Bar and Grill. He and his guide dog, Amelia, were crossing Rubitz Road when they were hit. Police say the driver, Donald Kroom, took off. According to investigators, he was borrowing a friend's car when it happened. The owner's mechanic saw the damage, alerted the owner, and the owner called police. Friends of the victim tell me he is one of the kindest people you will ever meet. A virus left him blind 16 years ago, but he's never let that stop him. He's a massage therapist. He's, he's been that for 10 years. He married a woman who's also blind about five years ago. I spoke with her by phone today. Despite his injuries, she says he's in good spirits. He's doing well. Doing really well, considering, you know, he's happy that the guy was arrested. She says her husband's guide dog was also hurt. The dog is being cared for by guide dogs for the blind. The owners of South Liberty Bar and Grill are planning a fundraiser to help support Murphy and his dog. You can find all the details at coin.com. As for the suspect, he had some warrants out for his arrest. Other charges against him include felony hit and run. Reporting live in Salem, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 News.